You like bitter drinks? Oh, he's no. been drinking. Then watch this one. <laughs> Welcome to Common Cocktails, Dan, Ian, <laughs> aka Dave, and I, Derek, are gonna Derek. make a cocktail for you called the Boulevardier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the Boulevardier is a drink that has history. We'll talk about it in a minute. Here's the recipe breakdown, and then I'll talk about more. It's an ounce and a quarter of rye whiskey, one ounce Capari, one ounce of sweet vermouth, orange twist. Done. That was Piece of cake. Piece of cake. Oh, you gotta stir it. Is it done yet? Yeah. <laughs> it's a stir drink. Come on. I'm gonna add ice to it. It's not gonna be bitter at all either, is oh it? It's just deconstructed. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this stir. is. What's that? Just make Dan stir it. <laughs> oh. oh. Here's not a stir it. Jen, we're gonna make Jen oh. drink. <laughs> we're gonna make Jen. Jen's he gonna tried, come up. Time. And Jen's gonna drink the whole thing because she loves Compart. Maybe we'll make her a Campari spritz. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll stir it if you're gonna drink it. <laughs> I actually had some Campari drink that wasn't bad. Whoa! No, yeah, it was. yeah, it was inside of a fucking swan. <laughs> oh, that's no, it. Yeah. No, that was bad. <laughs> we drank it. Wait, we did drink. I did drink it's it. It's a Campari oh, milkshake. What was the one that we tried on the, we tried on the show? It was actually. It was a, I'm telling oh, you, what right. it is. it's a Jungle Bird. <clears throat> it was a what? Jungle, jungle Bird. Jungle Bird. Jungle Bird. The Jungle Book. You guys make the Jungle Bird. The Jungle, jungle Bird. You can watch the Jungle Book. <laughs> no. Yeah, Mobile. Jungle Bird. Jungle Bird. It's a tiki drink. Uh, I don't. Yeah, you heard my recipe ingredients. So. You're gonna stir this with ice. Put it in a rocks or a coupe glass, depending on what you want to do. We're gonna put it in a rocks glass with ice, I'm guessing, because it's it's there, so I'm guessing that's happening. So as you can see, how <laughs> Ian is stirring versus uh, that atrocity that was Dan stirring last time we did this. Uh, what that's, drink was that? Okay. That's Everyone awesome. Everyone starts out rough. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Way to just shame me. Well, last time I get uh, uh, Ian National Network. Stir what the fuck? <laughs> stir shamed. <laughs> <on> international. <laughs> yeah, you just YouTube show. Exactly. Yeah. You just stir shamed me. <laughs> Stir shaming. Stir that shit. We need Next, to shame him. That's shame a fucking t-shirt. Like yeah. Stir shaming. The next. <laughs> I've been stir shamed. Eight episodes. I'll stir something. All right. You gotta give me some time. <laughs> he's, gotta, he's gonna work up to it. Yeah. You gotta stir for like two, three minutes, and then you're done. We're, it's on the rocks, but Ian doesn't need ice. I guess. It's not on the rocks, is it? Rocks. I don't really. Know. Usually you put it like. It's a rocks glass. Serve up. Nope. Yeah, it's, not, it's just it's up. Oh, it's like a fucking Negroni. Negroni. Yeah. No. Are you kidding me? With bourbon. Yeah. No, 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 no. Uh, Sazerac. I was yeah. thinking. Oh, okay. Because of the no ice thing. Negroni doesn't have ice. Oh. Did you twist it and run it around? The... No. Oh, fuck. Put your shit together. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't twist shame me. <laughs> you, you guys stir shamed me. So don't move your you thumb so much. Just, just, like, just let your thumb hold it. It's like okay. See, so you can do chopsticks. You can do. Okay, this. I can. See. So, <laughs> Okay. That's true. That's right. I'm so sorry. So now I gotta shave him. You're an something. asshole. <laughs> I've heard that started? already. <laughs> you gotta have to work on something Don't new. Stir shaming. <laughs> stir shaming. Dude, that's hashtag stir shaming. We got a new thing. That's awesome. Thank you. That's right. <laughs> Ooh, it smells really good. It's gonna be bad. <laughs> oh, that's a good drink. It smells like oh, like an orange. All right. Tell he loves it. <laughs> waiting. Yeah. You're waiting. Oh, there it is. It's in there. It's like Where's a. Perigo? This is this is like this is like a this is like an americano mm. that looks more like a negroni. I'm getting more used like, to them. Americanos are good. Yeah. No, this is like a negroni with bourbon, rye. Exactly. That's what a Boulevardier is. <laughs> mm. Dan's it's exactly what that is. We've talked about this every time we do a Campari drink. We talk oh, about nice. that, but we haven't done the Boulevardier again. Get him. Revenge? How is this Dan's re Oh, I get it. Because I get the pain. No, you get to do it. No. That's how no, bad it is. It's my revenge. He's getting. Eric, Dan is getting revenge. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Who says this? Thank you, Eric. Eric's like, <laughs> first. There you go, Eric. <laughs> you should, he just punched me in the hand. <laughs> is it better than a slap? No. Oh, I thought it would be. Why would it be better than a slap? Because there's less. less okay, yes, there's less stingy, but I can't feel it's, my thumb muscle. It's like now. holding pads, right? Yeah. No, because there's pads on when you do that. Well, don't stir shit. Well, there's that. <laughs> holding yes. pads. Oh yeah, it's just like holding pads without pads on. You okay. Don't stir shaming. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's been a while. So what I was gonna say. I Next really time we'll both do knuckles. It's, it's good. It's <laughs> oh yes, we're gonna punch each other's knuckles off. It's gonna yeah. be awesome. There you go. That's why you want to like and subscribe, because <laughs> the next time these fools are going to punch themselves in the face. we got to do it before the end of the night, because New Year's coming up. And... That's true. If you like Campari, if you like yep. Negronis, it's a good drink. Yeah, it's a good drink. Like it. It's a good drink. It's definitely, right. I'm getting more used to. I am Campari. too. Campari. Yeah. Campari and I'll tell you, I should, be, I should be it's like. It's easy as shit. 
I'm not I'm not yeah, getting that face. Yeah, see, because it's good. It's sweeter than a Boulevard. Uh, it's sweeter than a what's the other one? Negroni. Negroni. Yeah. Yeah. Because I don't know why. I guess the rye is sweeter than. Well, there's the a little shit. bit more rye. So normally a Negroni oh, yeah. is one one one, right, and yeah. this is one and a quarter of rye. So they just one. rounded off so a little. Like, normally I make the Boulevardios at the same ratio as the Negroni. Yeah, I wonder why they did so one and a quarter. Yeah, that's, that's why I was kind of. Um, the that ra- I don't think the rest. Of, I I can't recall yes, can where I got it. Can definitely be built in glass. Uh-huh. Um. Yeah. Oh, look at all that history. Fuck the history. I don't. Well, have if you're gonna keep the ice in it. You can build it in glass. Yeah. I wrote all that down, too. So the Boulevardier is from uh, Harry M- McKellen. I try to find it in, these are in, on the rocks. in their book. Unless I don't it's think like it was a in there. Huge yeah, unless ice. it's like a big ice cube. Yeah. 1927 to 1932. This is an old freaking drink. Well, yeah. So I don't know if they what they use. We use Car- Ar- Ar- Carpita and Ante- Ar- Carpano. Their show was probably Pica. like four years old, too. <laughs> it probably was. That's fresh! Yeah. Just saying. Um... Coupon code is whiskey18. Nope, that was like three months ago. Coupon code winter. is winter18. Save 18% off fuck. until the end of January because it's cold as fuck. Um, also, I said like and subscribe. Our executive producer is going to be uh, Janice. We did Plan Sweeby. No, Plan Sweeb. I don't know what the heck that is. Well, that must be like an encrypted name in there someplace. Or somebody's name backwards. I've seen that happen before. Oh, there you go. Um, people who don't like to be found. So, thank you for your support. So. <laughs> Go to patreon.com slash CMZ and you can donate. You guys have no idea how much work goes into the show beforehand. Yes, I mean, there are. I mean, it doesn't matter. Really, hours, minutes, seconds of I'm, work. I'm, I'm being sincere because, I mean, it doesn't come across when something like that happens, but a lot of work goes into it. it, it does, because <laughs> it doesn't come across that way because at the end of the day, we just don't fucking care. We just do whatever we're gonna do. Although there's a fucking oh, he cares. Look at He's all those just words. trying to make it. I didn't even. I wrote all these words. But he cares. That's why he cares. I know you there's do like a lot of work. There's like two paragraphs worth of words. I know. Yes. And I read you one line. So I'll throw those words. Because you take a sip, you get all thrown off because it's a little bitter. No. And then you stir shame me. <laughs> it. You know what? Well, Here's. You'd, you'd rather see, shame than give history. And you give. There's yeah. some, like the last line is very interesting. It says, however, from what I understand, the Negroni wasn't published. As a oh, recipe yeah. until 20 years after this cocktail was already in, right. in circulation in America. This, this I find that up. interesting because I always thought the Negroni came before the Boulevard The The thing is, they were created, one was I think in Italy and one was it's like in London or Paris. I think it might have been Paris, uh, wherever Harry was working. I, it's one of those things where they're both designed around the same time-ish, mm-hmm. but they didn't take notes. Like people didn't, they're not as fucking meticulous as they are today. New right, York. so yeah. you don't know the New York, it's funny, the New York bar is in Paris. Yeah. Um, so... They were both created around the same time. That's not to say somebody came from Italy and right. went to Paris, showed off a drink, they created it, and he modified it and made something different. But it's documented. But it's not documented. Yeah. So the documentation is for this prior to Negroni ever being put in a recipe book. So who knows what came first. That's interesting. Yeah. But they're both completely different. At the same time, there seems to be like some sort of 111 basically. Through a whole series of drinks, all containing very similar ingredients, but one change. Right. It seems hard. What's well, a they common would... cocktail recipe, though? Right. Yeah. Too. Like, especially true. back then. That's true. Yeah. yeah. You, Campari was a normal ingredient to use for certain in, uh, intriguing drinks. Sweet vermouth used. I don't know one why they didn't just simple. post the stuff on the internet and then you could have it and share it. And <laughs> they, I know. They yeah. should have put it on. What do they have? They, they should. Well, have they put, put it on one of the boats. Should have put it on the telegram. Yeah. Hmm. I can t- most telegram, that telegraph, shit. telewoman. Yeah. <laughs> Three fastest ways of communication back then. See? <laughs> at, at any rate, there is history. I'll put it into the description if you wish to read it. I just thought it would be humorous to just watch us do it and see what we thought rather than tell you all the dry notes, even though I wrote them down because I thought they were interesting to me. Um, and then shame us. And then I, the, the shaming was better. This recipe will go on, on go on to recipe.ostrich.com. We can get all the recipes that I we've all qualified by our taste buds. As well it should. And it usually takes two out of the three of us to say, yeah, this is good enough, and I'll put it in the book. Which means That's more than that. No, definitely. It's a yeah. classic. Yeah, you can't... Some of these drinks, they have to go in even if I didn't like them, because... Yeah. Like, I know these type yeah. of drinks are classic. You can't kick out the Negroni because it has history to it. Right. You have to, whether you like it or not, it's, right. it's mm. a big enough drink out there. And I'm yeah. getting better. Damn, Tommy. <laughs> Tommy! <laughs> From Alma Tequila. Oh. Um, oh that's going to have to be fist to fist. Oh, God! <laughs> Take off your ring, buddy. 
<laughs> That's it. If you're watching the live stream, you're gonna see the beatdown. Everybody else, uh, stay tuned for the uh, whatever comes next. The yes. Another drink. The, uh, another drink. What we do ahead of time. The, oh, the uh, lead-in. Lead lead stay in. tuned for the lead-in. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. The stuff we do ahead of time, after time. <laughs> yeah, we do it all backwards. It's like fucking. It's like an uh, what's that guy that right makes yeah, all those movies backwards? It's, it's, it's like a Tarantino film. Yeah. <laughs> like what you eat before you eat to make your hungry? Gelatin. What's gelato. going on? Gelato. You know, the, 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 with the mellow, the melon, and the mulatto. What happened? You weren't supposed to have an answer to that. But let me explain. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> all answers for you. <laughs> Sidebar holiday videos. Down below, our bartender starter kit for AustinDrakes.com. And that, my friends, is the show. We are teaching you how to drink. We'll start out slow and we'll go Okay. One, oh. two, ah. three. Ah. Oh, you're getting harder, Why do you keep doing that? <laughs> well, because we it didn't hurt at first or second or third, but the fourth one started to kind of feel like a little... <laughs> you know what? It was totally worth it. Yeah, it is a bitter drink here. Face. <laughs>